Ever look at a file name from a Cinema EOS camera and wonder, what does all of this mean? Let's find out. The first letter, camera index, A to Z, that's user defined. Very useful, especially on a multi-camera shoot. Next is the real number, customizable, and by default, advances each time a card is initialized. Double check to make sure the cards are in sequence on shoot day. Following that, clip number. This number advances automatically with each clip created and is also customizable by setting the initial clip number. Then the date set in camera at the time of recording, and two random alphanumeric positions designed to give each clip a unique name in the event another clip has the exact same everything else. Finally, five user-defined positions that are of course customizable. By default, C-A-N-O-N, so feel free to change it to any other letter-number combination you wish. If a clip has an XF-AVC proxy or subrecorded clip in tandem, you'll see an underscore P following the same file name as the original.